Hi YouTube, Timothy Unkert here. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to install Node on a Chromebook in 2025. I've got the Node.js website up, which is nodejs.org. Uh, this is the English version, so we have a forward slash en. And at the time of this recording, the long-term version of Node, or the long-term support version of Node is 22.14. So that's the one I'm gonna be installing. 23 is available, but it's not long-term support. So I'm not gonna go with that one. I would recommend going with whatever the latest long-term support one is. So we're gonna bring up a terminal here. You do have to have Linux installed on your Chromebook. I do have a video on that. I'll leave that in the card above. Uh, once you have Linux installed, you just wanna make sure you have curl installed. So I'm gonna type sudo apt get install curl. To be honest, it's always been installed on a Chromebook, so you probably do. Um, and we, we do see we have it installed here, so I'm just gonna clear that out. I'm gonna run the curl command. So I'm gonna do curl dash lowercase s, uppercase L, https colon forward slash forward slash deb dot node source dot com forward slash setup and then an underscore and then the version. I wanna do 22.x, that's the version 22 is the long-term, latest long-term support at the time of this recording. I'm gonna do a space, a pipe, another space, and then sudo um, dash uppercase E, a space, and then bash, a space and dash. And I'll hit enter and that's gonna go run and fetch um, the stuff I need and then, uh, so it's gonna basically configure the repository. So now to install Node.js, I'm gonna run sudo apt get install Node.js with a dash Y. Okay, and that's gonna run ahead and actually install Node.js. And we'll check that in a moment. Okay, so now we wanna check it. We can do node space hyphen V and we get version 22.14.0, which like I said, is the latest long-term support version at the time it's recording. We can also check for the node package manager and we'll type npm-v and we see we have version 10.9.2, which is at the time of the recording, the latest one that comes installed with it. Although I think if you install it and it's not the latest version, it'll give you a message on how to update it. It's really easy. You just run that command that they give you. Anyways, so Node is installed on your system. Hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, please give it a like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.